Big item trash day means we drive around and see what people put out for their trash. Oh, what's this is like a major clean out here. Oh, we got games. Should we rummage? Should we rummage? There's like options, rummaging options. Uh, oh, this is a cute little thing, luggage. Don't need a dresser. Okay, okay. Oh, this can be donated. This one's brand new sealed. Oh, don't need clothes. We'll donate that. I just realized it's my first time scoping out big item trash day and my new car. You want to see it? Oh, bam! Oh, usually chairs are broken. Yeah, this one's broke. So sad. So sad. If anyone wants to invent some glue or a way to fix chairs like that, I think, I think you can make some money there. I have a car that still has room, but now I really have to think about what I'm willing to shove in the back seat, you know? Like this. This is nice. Guess it's a wine rack. Looks beautiful. Am I gonna try to shove it in my car? Maybe my old car. This car. Uh, oh, little tables. Most of this stuff, like, you just gotta clean it up. I hope someone else gets that before the trash truck drivers come and get it. Before my sanitation dudes come and get it. It's my sanitation dudes. Now I feel like I almost gotta pull up behind them and say hi or something. These are someone else's sanitation dudes, but they're still sanitation dudes. There it goes, in the trash. And it could have been something maybe you could have kept if someone would have picked it up, but someone thought someone else was gonna pick it up, so they didn't. If you're afraid you'll hoard stuff, just drop it, just drop it right off for donation right when you get it. Just a game today to donate. Okay, great, thank you. Thank you, have a good one. You too, bye now. Bye. I would suggest looking up like food pantries or local donation places near you, not like big chain Goodwills and definitely not those things you see on the side of your street. I know it's convenient. I know it's convenient, but trust me, it's way better. Just don't donate to those.